Hello friends, welcome to this channel. Here I am going to share with you that how to solve the problem related to true centrifugal casting. Let me discuss about first centrifugal casting. It is one of the casting process in which molten metal is poured and allowed to solidify in a revolving mold. Here in this picture you can see about centrifugal casting. Here it is a casting mold which is rotated by by means of roller. The mold is rotated at a high speed so that molten metal is distributed by a centrifugal force to the outer region of the die cavity. Various types of centrifugal casting are true centrifugal casting semi-centrifugal casting and centrifuge casting. Here I am going to solve one of the GATE question which was asked in GATE PI 2019. The question is on your screen. Let me read the question first. True centrifugal casting process horizontal configuration is to be used for casting a metallic cylinder with outside diameter 0.275 meter and inside diameter 0.250 meter. If G factor is 65 and acceleration due to gravity is 9.8 meter per second square, the minimum rotation speed required is we have to find. Here the G factor is the ratio of centrifugal force experienced by a rotating cast metal to its weight. To solve this problem, let me see first the configuration of true centrifugal casting. Here in this picture you can see true centrifugal casting in horizontal mode. This is a casting mold and this is a liquid metal which is experienced a centrifugal force. To obtain a required dimension casting, the rotating speed should be select such that the liquid metal will not fall down during, down during upper half of the cycle, upper half of circular path. Here the G factor is equal to centrifugal force upon weight by substituting this value we got expression of g factor in velocity and radius here v is tangential velocity in meter per second and r in meter now consider outer radius of casting or we can say inner radius of mold for finding minimum rotating speed this is because a centrifugal force should be strong enough to hold the liquid metal stick to the wall of the casting. Now substitute V is equal to 2 pi r n upon 16 to find rpm to find rotational speed and, and by, by substituting this value in g factor we got rotational speed in this expression. By simply substituting all this value we got minimum required rpm is equal to 650 rpm required to get suitable dimension casting subscribe this channel if you want to see more interesting concept thank you very much